Hello and welcome to the WebDupy channel. In this tutorial, we will create a light bulb on off toggle effect without using images, just the CSS effects. So let's get started. So firstly, let's start with HTML document. I have already prepared connected styles and connected scripts. So firstly, I will create new element with wrapper class. Inside of it, element with light class. And inside of light element, I will create new element with class bulb. So it will be the main element of our tutorial. Inside we'll have two spans. Two spans will be used for two circle shapes from left and right side on the bulb. We will review this later. And after bulb element I will create the button. I will comment the button, let's hide it for now. And I will add as usual the main styles to the document. And for wrapper, I will add the main styles min height 100 VR. And I will center the light bulb element inside the wrapper. I will use flexbox to center this element. And for bulb, I will add position relative with height 80 pixels, background light gray, or the radius 50%. And let's transform rotate it on 180 degrees. I will add minus 50 pixels to move it to top, auto to make it centered and zero for bottom. So I will add on class to the body, so it means when bulb will be switched on, the class on will be applied to the body and therefore background of the bulb will be white and box shadow white as well. Selector will be used to add the top shape to the bulb, so it will be located over here. So let's add it. Top minus 50 pixels. The background color will be the same as we added to the bulb element. We will add border top. So it will be used for edge of the bulb over here. So let's add 30 pixels, solid and color black. So let's add border radius 10 pixels and it will be with circle edges over here. Okay. Also when bulb will be switched on, the background of the before selector will be changed to white color. So in general we need after selector when bulb will be switched on to add the filter blur effect to it. This block with blur effect will have width and height 120 pixels. And I will add 40 pixels to blur effect. Bulb spawn. The general styles for spawn will be position absolute, display block, we need two spans to make a circle edges over here, so let's code it. And for second span we need to add left radius, 40 pixels. So as a result we have a circle shape on these two edges. And for spans as we have added also for bulb. So we have added when or we have on class, the bulb will have a background white. We need to add 
uh, in the same way for spans. And on the last step, let's uncomment our button over here and let's add styles to the button. Let's locate it in the bottom. I will add simple properties just with border radius rounded and let's code it. So it's very simple properties added to this button. I will add also padding and pixels from top and bottom, 20 pixels from left and right. Let's add cursor pointer. And on the final step we need to add a toggle effect. So firstly we need to get access to DOM of BTN element. I will use query selector. And we need to get access to body element to toggle class on it. And when a class will be toggled on body, then the lamp will be switched on. Selector. Body. And I will add on click event to the button. And we will toggle a body element and therefore a bulb using on class and toggle method. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and it was very useful for you. All code to GitHub repository are listed in the description. Thanks for watching and see you in next tutorials.